you ever had someone tell you, that's just the way I am? Uh, or maybe you've used the term, that's just the way I am. In my many years of experience, uh, what that person is telling you is, I'm not going to change. And I can't change because that's just the way I am. And I've, I've talked with people in terms of nutrition, and they would say, well, we, I, you know, I'm, I'm eating this stuff that is not good for me. It, the science tells me that. Everybody knows that. But that's just the way I am. That's just the way I'm going to, that's the way I was brought up. That's the way I am. I think that would be one of the things that if I, if I were uh, a young lady, especially, if, if I had a, a uh, boyfriend who kept using that term, I would want to think twice <laughs> about any sort of marriage with him. Because what you see is what you're going to get, only you're going to get an older person still saying, that's just the way I am. And uh, there's evidently a kind of a feeling that that's, uh, it, it's not ex usually expressed that way, but it's like, I was born that way. And it, it's just some way I've got these genes and they've got a hold of me and uh, what I was yesterday, I'm going to be today. And what I am today, I'm going to be tomorrow. And because that's just the way I am. It, it doesn't make any sense to me as a scientist because I'm always looking for change. I know that everything's changing. And, and if I don't change, along with everything else changing, I become an anachronism. Your, your ideas and your actions become outdated. But it seems to me that, that um, and maybe it's just that I've had, had that much, had experience with so many people that were that way, that, that were ossified uh, somehow. And, and the, the, the term that is a dead giveaway for that is, that's just the way I am.